Skyhawk showdown requires a lot of determination and courage. 10 year old Ben Schwartz of Urbandale knows a thing or two about that and he'll be on the field Saturday. The fifth grader has douche and muscular dystrophy. His muscles get weaker and weaker over time and there is no cure. He goes to countless appointments and medical trials, which will also help other kids with the disease. He also goes to a ton of Cyclone football games, and before the season started, he got picked to be a kid captain. When he got the phone call, his huge smile um, on his face just washed over him, and he's like, then they said, okay, well, what game do you want to go to, Ben? Like, what's your preference? And it, without a second, he's like, Iowa. What's going to happen against Iowa on Saturday? I think they're going to win. Why is that? Iowa's quarterback is hurt, and their defense is doing all the work. Ben, oh my gosh. <laughs> he knows that Iowa defense does get it done, actually. The Hawkeyes were one of the best in the nation a season ago. They kept Utah State out of the game last week. Xavier Wampa had another interception, and this unit heads to Ames riding high. I mean, I think this whole team's confident. Um, you have to carry yourself with confidence, obviously, in order to go play in any college football game. So I um, think the team's very confident, and we're just, I mean, we're all fired up and ready to go. Here's the info for Saturday in Ames. It's a 2.30 kick on Fox. Each team unranked. Iowa's favored by three and a half, and we've got a half-hour pregame show Friday at 6.30.